Welcome to our Eureka meeting. Bruce, the spreadsheet shows an average of 2.5 volunteers available for an average of 3.6 hours. Look, Paul is our tech guy. He can plug that into a computer and we can make 2.5 calculate into 3.0. I cannot do that without redistributing the allocated volunteers for Friday's Trithlin into Diane's spreadsheet. Bruce, will you make me a map so I can see the volunteers' positions? I have many maps. I make maps into better maps and better maps into best maps. I can make a vector map out of a blank paper. Which map would you like? I need a map of the whole course so I can allocate the 2.5 volunteers. Let's ask our fire chief Rees. I need you to move courthouse buildings over one foot so I can park my Subaru next to the tent. Um, well, huh? Bruce, I guess I will see. I will check the city code to see if a building can be moved and if we need a permit. Bruce, I need water coolers and Gatorade. Can you ship coolers with Paul? Larry, if I move six coolers to Oak Grove and six coolers to Blue Eye, then we... Okay, okay, okay. The code book says a building may be moved on Thursday and Friday as long as the building is returned to its original location by Monday. Okay, I'll pick up and move the buildings for you, Bruce. Is there anything else you want me to do? Nothing right now, Reese, but I have your number. Oh, hi, Diane. Hi, Paul. Where is Thomas? He is putting up tent with all those volunteers. I need five volunteers to help me. Bruce wants to mark the course at 4 a.m. We need to look at the Google Docs spreadsheet to see who we have. Hi Thomas, Bruce wants you to stop putting up tents and go to triathlon. Hi Diane, hi Paul. I want to race but have to repave parking lot for transition. Thomas, do you have all the intersections covered in town or do we need Diane to get more people? We need more locals to give directions. Diane, can you get 20 people for all day? Okay, look, they are putting up the finish line, marking the course, setting the swim buoys, and working registration. We need to meet at Forest Hill and review the spreadsheet. Someone call Bruce. Where is Bruce? He is hanging from the finish line truss. I think he is part monkey by the way he climbs. Guys, we have just had a very good weekend. Over 400 participants here for three days from 10 states. Exactly, Mickey. We have had a great weekend. We have had almost 200 volunteers from all over. These people made this event possible. It was a good weekend. Did you guys see how we can improve the traffic flow downtown? Yes, by shifting the barriers after 9 in the morning, we can have two lanes flowing. We had so much fun at the feed and stations. We have already talked about how we can make it better. I read on GeekFest that some people were concerned. I will tell them how we are talking about making improvements. Where is Diane? I have a new Google Doc spreadsheet with feedback from everyone. Someone on GeekFest suggested we have a local artist make a really cool parking map for all the participants. We'd like to thank Eureka Springs Mayor's Office, Police Department and Fire slash EMS. As well as the COPC and Chamber of Commerce. Parks and Recreation, Eureka Springs Transit, Cornerstone Bank and of course Forest Hill Restaurant. Rotary Club, Faith Christian Family Church, Lovin Oven, Local Flavor, Mud Street Cafe, Plumley Photography and Inn of the Ozarks. Carroll County Sheriff's Office, Stone and Barry County Missouri Sheriff's Offices, Arkansas State Police, Barryville Chamber of Commerce, Barryville and Green Forest Police Department. Holiday Island Fire Slash Rescue, Holiday Island Rotary, Suburban Improvement District, Vacation Rentals, Blue Eye, Oak Grove, and Golden Communities. And there are lots of people who just came up to volunteer included my downtown friends. Yes Mickey we have so many people who made this possible because this ain't no small town operation thank you all and see you next year.